Uh, pastors, traditional pastors are fearful of small groups because they've either, either experienced or they've heard about small groups that uh, the leaders took the small group out in a split off of the church. Or uh, particularly in churches that are non-charismatic, they've always heard that these small groups get involved in the charismatic speaking in tongues and stuff like that, and that frightens non-charismatic pastors that their church, their small groups might do that. Uh, you know, so there's always rumors and things like that. Uh, that's something you have to work with and get over this uh, insecurities of the pastors. Uh, the truth is, when you look across the board at all churches in the United States, uh, there's relatively few problems in small groups, relatively. Uh, but there's always some, and then, of course, those rumors get started, and they get overblown sometimes, and pastors get pretty fearful about them. But you do have to do wise training and wise development of leaders and wise oversight of leaders. What many pastors are finding that works for them, that makes them feel secure, is that the small groups study the Sunday morning message. And that's right. So the pastor... Uh, usually it's larger churches. They'll have somebody who's directing the small group ministry. And the pastor has to let them know ahead of time what they're preaching on. And then that small group leader will typically develop a study sheet and some, you know, some questions and stuff like that. And then that will be given out either uh, by hand on Sunday or more and more today it's put online. And small group, group leaders just go online and download this next week's study questions. So then when they come to church, they're able to bring that sheet with them, and they're listening to the pastor preach, but they've already got their study questions, and so they can take notes and stuff, and then the next week in their small group, that's what they talk about. Now that is powerful because it actually, you know, anytime you can take what the pastor's preaching and then discuss it and start applying it to your lives, you're, you're drilling down deeply with that. And so it's very powerful. And most churches are finding that probably 80, 90% of their small group leaders want to do this because they don't have the time with their own jobs to develop their studies. So why not use something that's pre-prepared for them? But a small church pastor, that's just another thing to do. You know, they're doing their message, and now they've got to develop a study guide on top of that. And it just gets a little bit hard to do in a small church. Uh, just just extra workload uh, for them. But that's a way to go. That helps pastors feel more secure because right. everybody's talking about their message and not getting off track on other things.